Got the e-lemonade card out again, do a little bit more testing. It still has the My 1020 48 volt 1000 watt motor on it. And the four 12 volt 12 amp hour batteries. I'll test it with the multimeter here real quick just to see what it shows our batteries are holding. Well, it seems to be showing 53.5 volts as of right now. 53.5. Let's see what the meter up front shows. Well, our meter in the front here shows 53.0. I guess it's pretty close, within a half a volt, 0.5, I guess. But we'll give her a try. Get the switch on. Alright, thumb throttle. And right here in the grass, we're just going to zip right across the grass and everything. <laughs> And the time is 2.30 p.m. So we'll keep track of how long it lasts, too. Try to anyways. Here we go. Zero amps. I want to see what it does as a full throttle right off the line. Thirty-one. zero
straws on a burnout. We're at zero. What is that? <laughs> Try that again. Don't no, check. Battery settle. About 15? 15. Used to be gas, I put an electric motor on it. No, I bought it off the internet. It's four go-karts. It's four go-karts. About a hundred bucks. Oh shit. That's slick though. That's why I'm testing now, see how long it'll last. It's now about 2.46, that's about 15-16 minutes of consistent driving. I check everything out. Oh yeah, it's a little warm. Not that you can't touch it or anything, but it's a little warm. Oh, tires are warm too. Yep. Beat controller just barely warm. Batteries. Eh. Nothing dramatic. Checking for hot spots. No, everything seems to go. And let me see what our meter says. Point two. So yeah, we're still pretty close. 